so welcome got another review here I just got this like about three days ago at um, Faded's it's like a German toy store <clears throat> not far from here probably about 3k's in a shopping center it's the same place where I got that um, Boeing 737 and as you can see I got it uh, reduced it's not bad it's about 20 bucks at the current rate so yeah, there's two versions of this helicopter. You got the pullet tie. That version looks pretty sweet too. And of course the Metstar from Miami if I'm not mistaken. I'm not really sure. It's also pretty colorful and nice looking. Let's see, 130 seconds scan. I haven't gotten a 130 second skill kit in like ever. So yeah, that's pretty much the box art there. Not bad. Nice. Let me get some uh, pictures of what the model could look like. Got there the front canopy, windscreen section, rotor blade. And what is that, the intake? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, the exhaust with the turbine there. Some side detail or rear detail of the doors that open up. And just some information there. The helicopter in German, French. English and God, I don't know. I think that's a uh, Greek, maybe or Dutch. I'm not sure. So let's open this guy up. Have the instruction. That's nice. Really nice, I have to say. Okay, the instructions and then the decals here. Lots and lots of decals. Nice. Okay. Decals for the instruments and center console, upper ceiling. Circuit breaker panel board, of course your cockpit, some other decals there, safety and whatnot. Very nice. I think that's for the ambulance part of it. The rear, I'm not sure. Oh, it even has uh, decals for the sliding uh, window on the cockpit, I believe. I think that's what it's for. So, yeah, lots of caution decals for a ground, I think. No, that's not ground. Electrical outlet, I think that's for the APU access door, that E looking decal. That's nice. So we got safety advice. Let's go through the decal the instructions real quick. Standard gravel or rebel, depending on how you pronounce it. 
<clears throat> Got your color sheet and like a lot of languages. <laughs> Then you got your parts tree section of it. Help you locate the parts. It's a lot of parts. a lot of parts aren't being used but that's okay so I'm just gonna go real quick through the instructions so you guys can see more or less what you're up against if you decide to buy this kit Where the decals go, I think. For the oxygen tank, whatever else that is. you gotta pay attention to the instructions because you have two versions police and the medstar so. and of course more options within the two but the instructions are pretty clear Very nice. I'm looking forward to starting putting this together. When I don't know, there's a swash plate for the blades and transmission shaft and all that. I think. Hmm, two versions there. That one or that one. Hmm. So yeah, a lot of steps. Of course, I'm sure for some of you it's not enough. You know, get your scratch builders up there. I'll probably add some stuff too, because uh, with every kit, it's not gonna be 100% accurate. I'm sure. I've looked at uh, this bird online, and there's some discrepancies from. what other people have uh, <clears throat> looked into especially ones that are familiar with this helicopter and lots of steps. Hmm. Nice. Okay. 
almost done. Cutters. I think that's a searchlight. Yep. Man, oh man. Okay, that's probably the winch. Not bad. So, 70 steps. Well, 71 with the decals. Lee County, Florida. Yep. So. Very nice. And correct it. More steps. Here's for the outside detail. Placing the decals. Very nice. And of course, get the German police version. Four steps. with the clear parts. And I won't take them out of the bag for now, so I'll just see if you guys can see it from here. In the cabin windows and whatnot. And from what I can see here, it's clear. I don't really see scratches. See if I can zoom in with this. Okay, it's not working with that. So you can see clear. Very nice. See the little any bumps on the window, same? They're not flat. And here we have the windshield, the main cockpit window. It looks like there's an indentation in there, sinkhole maybe. But it's easily, re easily repairable. Yeah, I 
at least it's where it's at and not on the sides well, that would be a bigger problem but other than that everything else is tip top shape and I guess you can paint yeah you can paint it it's race detail if you don't want to use the decals for that so yeah that's the clear parts put it back in the bag Wow, oh, this bird is huge. Wow. You gotta be careful with this one. This one has raised rivet detailing. But man, look at that. Let's see if I can get the camera to focus. Yeah, see? Nice, look at that. Same thing with the other side. Yeah, you can see it there. Very nice. The bottom where the skit goes. Search line. Of course the rear doors. So yeah. That's nice. Going to the next part straight. We have the engine cowlings and whatnot. Very nice. And I have yet to see any flash on these parts. And these panel lines are not raised detail either. There's some rivet detail there on the tail fins. Even around the position lights. See there? Very nice. Let's get the rest of these parts down here. Let's see. Now we have the seats. Even head heads are included. That's nice. <clears throat> There's a flur, I guess you could say. I don't know if it's flur or well, yeah, because I think the police uses it. So it's nice. <clears throat> Tenons and all sorts of details. Headrest. And seat frames to slide it back and forth in the cabin. Lots and lots of detail. Now let me open this bag up. Okay, 
anything that just skids. Detail, detail. Even in skids. Wow. Very nice. Okay, and I think this like for the oxygen unit here for the ambulance with more inner workings. Five point harness. Nice. Headrest and stuff. Frames for the seats. As you can see here. There's a lot of them. The next one, I'll just leave that one in there. Interior detail for the cabin, just the back part thing. Blades. Sorry about that. My wife just called. Okay, I'm to business. Okay, we did this part over. So there we go. Seats, seats, seats. Just open up and open up. And as well. Uh. Careful with this because I still want to use these bags. There we go. So, like I said, here's the bottom of the cabin, front cockpit area. See, that's where the seats would slide. God, that's even detail, too. Cool. Yeah. Man. Turbine exhaust. Or so it's an old kit though, you can see there. Or old I guess by today's standards. Two thousand five. Made in Germany. Here's a uh, center console sides for the cockpit. And last but not least. Got a blade here. I guess this broke off the side or oh, don't matter. So there's one blade. More seats. And the interior cabin, like I was saying before. Very nice. So, for the doors, 
that's detail, man. And of course, again, the cockpit. Instrument panel, I mean. Nice. Well, that's it for this review. Or unboxing, I should say. I didn't really review it. But, I know, um, Werner's Wings makes a detail set for this. And, yeah, look him up under the night if you're interested. Werner's Wings.com. Take it easy, y'all.